So today we're going to look at how to manage a Cisco 840 phone with Meraki Systems Manager. There are some prerequisites, please read. This includes enrollment and general deployment guide considerations. So why do you want to do this? Well, you can fully manage a device, leveraging all of the various security features. You can provision the device with applications, accounts, etc., removing the need for users to do this. And you can also further protect any corporate data that stays on the device as well. So let's get started. The links are below in the description, but make a note of all of the applications on the right hand side. So let's head on over to play.google.com forward slash work. We're going to search for the first of those bundle IDs that we saw in that list. And it should be at the first. So let's click on that and let's click approve and approve again. Now, what we are going to do is when this comes up is keep it automatically approved. Let's head on over back to the Meraki dashboard and click applications. We're going to go into the top right hand corner and accounts and sync the Android Enterprise apps. What we'll do is just quickly refresh the, the page and you'll see all of the applications appear. By default, applications will be scoped to no devices. So we're going to make sure that our Cisco 840s will actually get this. Let's click Save. We're now going to head over to Settings and we're going to create a new setting. We're going to call this Cisco 840 system apps and what we're going to do is because all of the Cisco applications are already on the device we're just going to make sure that they're there by default so again we'll add our tag we'll click add settings and we're going to search for Android and then we can look at our system apps again we're going to use that list that we saw earlier and we're going to paste in all of those bundle IDs and here they are just for reference again. So let's very quickly do that. Once we've clicked them all in, let's click save. Now we're going to create a new setting and we're going to call this Cisco 840 Managed App Config because the first application that we're going to set just to show you how to do this is going to be the buttons application. So again, let's use our tag. Let's go to add settings and just type in there we go, Manage App Config. We'll select Android, we'll select the Buttons application. Just after a few seconds, it will come back with the configuration. So we're actually going to click Show Supported Settings to show what is actually supported, and it's a bundle. So let's create that. Let's click the plus. We're going to create a Button Settings Bundle. We'll click plus again, and we're going to configure the left button. We'll click the plus underneath this because this is an array. And we're going to now say that this is going to be the button left and we're going to run an application. There we go. And then we hit the plus again. We're going to say button left run application. And we're just going to type in the WebEx Teams bundle ID and click save. If we now head on over to device, we're just going to open the buttons application and as you can see it's configured for webex so what we're going to do is just press the configured button on the device itself and as you can see webex loads thank you